There has been clamour to get inside the ground tonight for a much anticipated game. The uh, roads outside of the stadium have been bumper to bumper with traffic. The car parks are full. There is a torrent of humankind making its way from the nearby station. And we expect every seat to be filled. An atmosphere of uh, great expectation and excitement. It is a venue this which simply adds to the spectacle of the game it stages. One of the most impressive arenas in this part of the world. Well, this is the perfect game for all parties, not least the neutrals who've just come to enjoy it. Well, under normal circumstances, this is a massive matchup, and I'm not totally in agreement with the view that friendlies tend to take the edge away. In my experience, if the opposition go at it full tilt, then you have to reciprocate. We like to see excitement and be entertained. But if it does go down the serious route, there'll still be lots to enjoy. We have already started here. Who do you think this turns on, Jim? Yeah, Leonardo Bonucci. He's as imposing as they come, Peter. And he knows just how to use his, his physical attributes to make life difficult for attackers. He's also got a very good eye for a killer long ball, so don't be surprised if you see him launch a few counter-attacks for his team today. Yeah, I must agree, especially in view of his ability to lead and organise the defence. Jorginho with the short one. Insignia delivers. Here comes another massive leap! He will be livid with himself. Oh, no, that was a chance. What a chance. Saul. Thiago. Spain still to register a shot on target. Across the field it goes. Italy have made it clear what they're trying to do for me, Peter. What are they trying to do? Well, I think they're making the pitch as big as possible to work both flanks into, into better supply routes. Martinez. Plays it over to the other flank. And it's Gaia. Lorenzi gets good distance on it. Nicely controlled. And here's Rodrigo. Oh, managed to get it away. Chiesa. Florenzi. Now it's Immobile hits it! Isco, and it's played forward. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Well, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Yeah, I mean, he, I think he did well to, to spot the run, he just didn't get enough behind it. It happens. Still, rather frustratingly, it is nil-nil. Rodrigo plays it out to the flank. Played into the middle. And back out it comes. It's a throw-in.
and it's Saul. And here's Rodrigo. A really good feat. Rodrigo goes for the cross. Bonucci is there, and he can get that clear. Gaia. There is the half-time whistle. So both sides have drawn blanks. They have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. And after 45 minutes, it is still goalless. A change, perhaps, after half-time. And we're off again. Well, the first half didn't really produce the goals we'd have liked. Hopefully they've been saved for the, the second. For that to be the case, though, we'll need to see more energy and invention early on. Spinazzola. Insigne provides an outlet. Well to get his head on that, but couldn't score. Now that was a slick move, and there were several options in the box to uh, to pick out. <laughs> Jorginho plays it short. Hits it first time! A real chance and a real let-off. Saul. Sergio Ramos. Martinez. Gaia. Thiago. Still waiting for the game to take off here. Nil nil. Thiago. Isco. Nice touch. Thiago. Now the cross. Jorginho with the clearance. Not long left, and still we await the breakthrough. Could be a chance here. No messing about, just bludgeoned away. Martinez. Gaia. Thiago, Gaia, Jose Gaia going full steam ahead down the left flank. Ah, oh, now some movement on the bench, and we are going to see a change. <laughs> Played in deep. Tries to get it clear. Florenti drives it forward. Jorginho. Bonucci. Italy have it back and they can go again. A Serbi tries to get it forward quickly. Italy merit full marks for their attitude and application in trying to win this. It means an awful lot, obviously. Martinez. Jorginho. Well, they've got one eye on the clock, but the balancing act is very fine at this stage. Go for it, and it could backfire. Sit back, and it may be at a price. Jorginho. 
Italy have to get it into the box and quickly. That is terrific skill. And here's Insigne. And it's Jorginho. Marco Verratti. Now it's Verratti. Marco Verratti turns and goes back. Lorenzo Insigne. There's great lead! Good delivery. No joy. It is going to need 30 more minutes. No winner after 90. Well, nil-nil doesn't offer a fair reflection of what we've seen. The game's been vibrant. I think the atmosphere has remained.